I knew you'd come find me sooner or later. What tipped you off? You killed my soldiers, but you helped my family when I couldn't. Even if we're apart, I know they're safe thanks to you. It's the least I could do. The world is so chaotic now. The cult made it that way. We're living in divided times. Sparta against Athens. Old against new. <laughs> and do you think the cultists aren't stoking the flames on both sides? I've seen what they can do. What they're willing to do. I want what's best for Arcadia. I'll consider what you have to say. It's not too late. Leave the cult of Cosmos and join Brasidas. You expect me to trust you? After how you slaughter the monger? I know what you do to cultures. I won't bow my head just for you to cut it off. That wasn't my plan. Then I should thank you for letting me face death as Spartans do. Dead. This complicates things. One less cultist seems simple enough. La Roche was a dear friend once. I should have been there. I'm sorry, Brasidas. But when Logos joined the cult, he sealed his fate. So you execute the manga in public against my advice, and now you kill La Roche? If you were under my command, you wouldn't be. Anymore. I don't follow orders. I do what I have to. So it's done. I suppose you'll be wanting to report the news to Sparta soon. You're right. We've done all we can. It's time to go to Sparta. Yes, it's time we returned. Barini, you are as determined as ever. I'm sure you will regain your house soon. With Lagos dead, arrangements must be made to ensure Sparta doesn't starve. Arcadia is safe once more. And the bounty is lifted. We are free to travel without fear. Then let's continue our journey.
Can I help you with something? I accepted a fat bounty on a leader. But he's hired a mercenary of his own for protection. A real bastard, too. Not sure I can manage both of them myself. You want me to run my blade through his skull? I know it's a tall order, but I want this mercenary dead. You haven't heard? That's already been taken care of. By me. Then I believe this is yours. You have my thanks, friend. Doesn't look like this life is offering you much. But another awaits aboard my ship. Sail with me. We need someone like you. Don't you think more than one mercenary on a boat could get a little... crowded? I'm afraid I can't join you. You'd have loved Varnavas, but fine. I'm here to face the kings. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Alexios. But are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? <sighs> I don't know. Maybe I should look some more. Accusing a king is not something you can take back. Make sure you're absolutely ready. I'm here to face the kings. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Alexios. But are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? I'm sure. I'll gather the Afors and meet you in the throne room. Who are the Afors? You don't remember? Then again, you were only a child. The five Ephors are elected from the citizens of Sparta. 
They have power over even the kings. You need to convince them if you wish to save Sparta from the cult's control. See you in the throne room. What are we waiting for? Sorry to keep you waiting. You summoned the Air Force? You must have achieved some success to earn this adoring crowd. I brought home a wreath for Sparta. Though, I had to enter the games and win it myself. Very good. But what of our Pankration champion, Testicles? There was an accident at sea before he could compete. Games are hardly important. What about Viotia? Stentor and I defeated the Athenian forces. You have nothing to worry about. If you have nothing but good news to share, why did you call for the Air Force? We were told serious charges would be brought. Serious charges? Against whom? You act as if you don't know. Against you, Pausanias. Sparta must be rid of Pausanias before it's too late. He's a member of the cult of Cosmos, and a traitor to Sparta. A Cosmos cult? What are you going on about? Is this some kind of joke? I have the proof. Right here. Your proof is right there. You know he's guilty. This isn't proof of anything. Ephos should only be called upon for serious matters. This lack of evidence is a waste of our time and disrespectful to the thrones of Sparta. The accuser should be made an example of for all other reckless fools. I taught him poorly. Punish me as his mother instead. We gave you every chance to prove yourself. Invited you back for a royal audience. And this is how you repay us? What say you, Archidamos? Alexios and Marini of Agiad. Your names are cursed. May the Cryptia hunt you, and the Elotes scrape the meat from your bones! Agreed. A wise ruling. Too bad you don't have a mask or a black cloak to save you this time. You're there? In their feet! <laughs> Pafsanias revealed himself before I was dragged out of there. So he is the cultist king. It would be wise to deal with him as soon as possible. I will. When you've dealt with him, meet me at home. With pleasure. Ares has chosen me to lead the Spartans to glory. There can only be one. Sanias is part of the cult of Cosmos. I'll have to kill him myself. There's Pafsanias.
Alexios! You are condemned to be hunted! I should have been more certain before accusing Pausanias. He is a plague on Sparta and its territories. And you say you are sure now? Where is he? So he can defend himself. It doesn't matter. It does to me. I found proof he was a member of the Cult of Cosmos. Undeniable proof. This letter was written and signed by Pausanias' own hand, outlining the progress of their plans in Sparta. What is this Cult of Cosmos? You've mentioned them over and over, as if I should know. They are a secret group with one goal. To seize power. They're using this war to strengthen their position. I find it difficult to think Papsineus was using Sparta this whole time. We've ruled together for years. I'll speak with the Ephors to confirm what you say. But if it's true, you deserve to be called a Spartan citizen once more. And of course, your family home is yours again. Thank you. One more thing. Yes? Should you decide to rule Sparta yourself, at least let me face you in battle. <laughs> I'm not made for ruling, my king. It's gone. What's gone? There was a skull here, a small rabbit skull, from your first hunt. Why would someone take that? There is only one person who would have taken it. Nikolaos. Maybe seeing each other again made him think of this place. He did the same to me. Seems I wasn't the only one yearning for home. I hope I'm not intruding. Rasidas, come in. It's good to see the two of you back home. It feels good to be here. You're here instead of in training. What's wrong? I'm heading to Pilos as soon as I can. I think you may want to come as well. I'd be happy to return the favor. What's waiting for us in Pilos? Glory. The Athenians are pushing the Spartans back even as we speak. It would be a devastating loss for Sparta, and I can't allow that to happen. Sounds like you've lost confidence in Sparta's warriors. They're as strong as they've ever been. But now they're facing a power they can't even imagine. Do you mean Vimos? Yes, that's what the rumors say. A force of nature in the body of a mortal who can cut down any soldier in her path. If Vimos is in Pylos, we have to stop her. I'll wait for you at the ship, but be quick. Each moment we waste is another Spartan dead. Cassandra is in Pylos. You have to bring her back, Alexios. Bring her back? We have our home again. We can be a family. It isn't too late. I'll bring her back, no matter what. This is serious, Alexios. We may not get another chance. I understand. She must have seen the cultists for what they truly are by now. It doesn't matter what you have to do. Bring back your sister. You must. Nothing will stop me. I shouldn't keep Rasitas waiting. Be safe, Alexios.